hey, you seem like a pretty cool dude. Do you want to talk about zero to the zero and why it equals one? No, zero to the zero is undefined, man. See, it goes like this. Zero to the zero is equal to zero to the one minus one, which is equal to zero to the one times zero to the negative one, which is equal to zero over zero. And division by zero is undefined. Therefore, zero to zero is undefined. Okay, I like that. That was a fun demonstration. I knew right away you were a cool dude. Now I have a follow-up question for you. If we have zero squared, that would be equal to zero to the three minus one, which would be equal to zero to the three times zero to the negative one, which would then be equal to zero cubed over zero. But I see division by zero, and we know division by zero is undefined. So does that mean zero squared is undefined? That's a really clever argument, but that is not correct because these zeros would cancel, and this would give you zero squared over one because you could cancel one zero from top and bottom. And that makes your statement here incorrect. So let's get rid of it. Okay, that was a good argument. I see how you did that. You made this zero down here, a zero to the one, and then you basically subtracted one from each of these, reducing both top and bottom by one term of zero. So what is three minus one? Three minus one is two. And what is one minus one? One minus one is zero. Do you see what I see? You got to your conclusion without even realizing that you were saying zero to the zero equals one. You did zero to zero equals one. That's how you got where you were. Oh, wow. I was not correct when I said zero, zero is undefined. Instead, I should have said zero to the zero equals one. Going forward, I will now say that because that is what is correct.